VMS business, I just don't see how it's gonna drive significant revenue for my business. I, I really can't see it. Actually, that's a myth. VMS business can drive significant revenue for enterprise recruitment agencies. True, margins on VMS jobs are low, but many firms manage VMS business at a high enough volume to see a solid chunk of their revenue come from it, more than 25% in many cases. Low margins on VMS jobs are a killer. They're the biggest reason that recruitment firms don't pursue VMS business hands down. Yes, margins do pose a problem, but the biggest hurdle that keeps enterprise recruitment agencies from pursuing VMS business? Recruiters can't connect with hiring managers. Enterprise recruitment agencies are definitely using automation to their advantage with VMS work, no doubt about it. Actually, that's far from true. While enterprise firms could use automation to submit candidates through VMS systems, most still do so manually. Oh, automation? It's had a huge impact on how successful enterprise recruitment agencies have been with their VMS business, for sure. It has, but most respondents don't actually know how impactful automation's been on their fill rates, total number of placements, or time savings for their firm's VMS business. But the majority of decision makers say automation has resulted in a higher fill rate for VMS jobs. Turning a profit with VMS? No way, that is impossible. True, VMS jobs are generally low margin, and three out of four enterprise leaders think VMS criteria keep bill rates and margins too low. But most leaders haven't actually automated many of the processes that keep costs high. Things like candidate screening, formatting candidate submissions, and submitting candidates through VMS. Cutting costs on these time-consuming steps can help to offset low margins with VMS business. Gross margin? It's definitely the most common metric enterprise firms use to track VMS business, for sure. Surprisingly, that's not the case. The most common metric that firms use to track VMS business is the number of hires through VMS each month. A close second and third, average gross margin and number of job orders per month. Absolutely. Lowering the cost of VMS jobs is everybody's top priority. Not true. Most people doing business with VMS say speeding up the rate at which they fill VMS job orders is their top priority. 